Okay. So we've got the Minotaur. You gonna you gonna fight? What are you gonna do? I'm under attack. Help me. He's just gonna walk around and take a tour of the place while I'm being shot at. Welcome back everybody to No Man's Sky. I'm an old guy gaming and in this episode we're going to do stuff. I don't know what it is, but we'll figure it out. <laughs> um, but we got <coughs> a couple of things that we have to take care of first. Um, one thing I'm confused about though is that we have a mission or a quest here to... Uh, right, we were... We, oh, that's right, we were looking for... We need to go find fungal mode for the acid, but... It says um, to install the Sentinel hard frame right arm on my my Minotaur, but it's already installed. If we look at this, see he's got the hard frame right arm installed, so I don't know why that quest has not updated. Uh, it looks like the drone wants to talk to me. Uh, let's, let's see what he has to say. Yes, Minotaur, yes, good, affirm, good. Oh, bad, bad negative. The hive has disrupted your settlement. The settlers are fragmented. See them? Leave. Come with you? Okay, so yeah, we gotta go to our settlement because apparently it's under attack, uh, under attack from Sentinels. And then I guess we're looking for fungal, fungal mold or whatever to make the acid stuff. So, Humboldt Drive Module. I think we bought that to save it for when we get the Nautilus aircraft. And we're out of power here again too. You know what? Let's just go Let's just go up to our freighter. And go from there. What is oh, if I don't put him back on his thing, what does he do? I guess he's just going to stand there until whoa. <laughs> we just give him <laughs> We just scalp the poor guy. Uh, I guess he just sits there until we call him to us. We we can call him to us, you know, from our... <laughs> that was funny. Uh, from our freighter. Okay, so let's dock at the freighter. we got to get our, our frigates going again, too, here. Okay, let's, uh, let's do the frigates first. This is pretty much just a, a, a daily chore. Well, not a daily chore, but a regular thing we have to do to keep these up. Or we get to do. Uh, so yeah, let's do this first. Okay, so uh, we finished with our, our frigate fleet stuff. 
And uh, so now what we're going to do is we're going to teleport to our uh, settlement uh, because they are under attack and then do the next thing there. Maybe what we'll do is we'll, we'll call our Minotaur uh, to help us with this little battle here just to see how it does. Okay. So we got the Minotaur. You gonna you gonna fight? What are you gonna do? I'm under attack. Help me. He's just gonna walk around and take a tour of the place while I'm being shot at. What? Where are you going, dude? All right, come here. That's the, the thing that does the dot. Yeah, we got we definitely gotta upgrade this guy some more. He's, he's not doing that much damage. Okay. If you want something done, you gotta do it yourself. So there it goes. But in his defense, he's not upgraded yet fully, so. I don't know why he's not like doing any fighting at all though. All right, so we got got them taken out. You're kind of worthless, man. You look cool. But you ain't worth a shit. <laughs> okay, let's uh, let's go over here and that's some voodoo witchcraft stuff going on right there. Um, let's see what this has to say. Answer citizen questions about the sentry. Reassure citizens demand obedience. The citizens have grown curious. They note the sudden and traumatic appearance of the sentinel hard frames and that the overseer appears to be accompanied by a rogue drone. Resolution required. Respond to the citizen question about the sentry. Um, deepening curiosity. No, I'm not going to be an asshole. Let's just reassure them that, hey, it's all, I got it under control. Citizens are pleased by your words. They have lived in fear of the Sentinels their entire lives and now hope for peace. They wish to assist you in your search for answers and have prepared an expedition. Um, sent to an abandoned building, sent to a monolith. I, why does it matter? Let's go to the abandoned building. Okay. Simple materials for the multi-barn. Magnetized ferret required for the roof. Okay, so we got the... Looks like the walls are done on that. Now we got to do the roof. Um, Sentry broadcast detected vocalization signal weak. All right, where are we building this barn at? I think it was over here. Yeah, I think it's over this way. Okay, we need 140 magnetized ferrite. Let's go here. And rare resources. Um, no, that's actually, I think, in just normal resources, actually. Basic resources. Yeah, right here. Okay, so that's taken care of. In the crater. Um. <clears throat> okay. Yeah, I'll put that away in the storage later. 
Okay, so now let's take a look at our quest. Manager said, well, the administration terminal has something else it wants us to do. Okay, let's go see what it wants. So I was told uh, during the multiplayer live stream that we did on Sunday that if I keep following the settlement, you know, quest line, that I'll get stuff to update, uh, continue to upgrade the Minotaur. So. That gives us a good incentive to keep doing it. View settlement status. 27% happy. They're in debt by 10 million. I don't know, is that worse or better than it was before? I think it's worse. <laughs> um, okay, yeah, I don't know how what I can do about these negative things. Um, maybe I can't do anything about them. Just kind of random, I suppose. All right, I guess we're done here. There's nothing else to do. Let's take a look at this again. The administration... Settlement status can be seen. Oh, okay. It's just telling me to continue, you know, ongoing stuff there. Okay. So, um, install self-greasing servos. This is where what we need to do now. Uh, so we need to go find fungal mold on toxic planets. And in order for us to make acid to do this... We need 600 fungal molds to make one acid. And we just need one. Okay. So, yep, yeah, we're going to have to find a... We're going to have to find a toxic planet. This is a, an irradiant planet, so this doesn't fit the bill for us. You know, I should probably build a launch pad down here. Thing is, though, is that might interfere with the new buildings. You know, like this one here. So, yeah, let's, let's not worry about that right now. Because if I built the launch pad in the place where the, you know, the next quest building needs to go, that might break something. So, I don't want to take that chance. Okay, let's go up into space. And take a look at uh, this system. Okay, that's star ball. That's temperate. Desolate. That's a temperate planet, but it has aggressive sentinels. Did we actually visit that place? I don't remember. Okay. That's cactus flesh. That's where we are now. That has fungal mold. So let's go to this Smatran place. that. Yeah, we want to go to Smatran, rename and upload hide system view, set waypoint, and then we'll go to this new uh, Yugian. Okay, I think we have a plan, Stan. Uh, we might need to... Use a teleporter, because how in the hell am I supposed to find it? There's only what four, four, four billion of these stars, or something like that. I don't even remember the number. It's it's so big that it's not even worth thinking about. Um, yeah, we, uh, we're probably gonna have to see if we can teleport to the space station in Smatran. Okay, so let's go back to our freighter then. Matrin right here. Whilst we're here, uh, let's take a look at 
target outside local system. Let's take a look at the Exocrap modules. And we'll pick up some more of this too. Okay, so Minotaur Cannon Module, installable upgrade. We'll grab that. can't install it from here. I gotta be closer. Okay. Fair enough. A class crater. So we just have to find that toxic planet. It was a smaller planet. It could be this one here. Yeah. No, that's a nuclear planet. That's a nuclear planet. Radiation. What about this? I think we just looked at that one, right? Yeah. Um, let's go out this way. looking here. Okay, so it's <clears throat> it's new Yugian. It's probably on the other side of this big planet here maybe. So let's pulse over there. I'm guessing it's probably this one here. So let's head aim towards that. Make sure we have our toxic protection installed. That's radiation. So we'll take our heat modules off. And we need to find our toxic. This is toxic. That's cold. Thermal, 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 radiation, uh, personal shield. Coolant, heat damage. Okay. Yep, I think that's as good as that's going to get. Uh, we need to charge them, though. Oops. Call our freighter here so our sentinel can hang out with us. Is he coming? Some big critter over there. Um Okay, so we have the freighter here. Why didn't the Sentinel come with him? I don't know. I'm, I'm missing something. I don't know. Okay, let's, um, let's do some scanning. We might as well make some extra money. Oh, look at that dude over there. Check him out. That's funny. Weird. Um, so, we're looking for fungal mold. It'll probably show up as the three yellow stars. I need to scan on those guys. My ship's in the way. This 
guys are bizarre, man. It's like a cross between a an owl and a and a freaking gulper, maybe. <laughs> so weird <laughs> I love it absolutely love it okay anyway um so yeah let's see if we can find some fungal mold uh, I'm not seeing What I, I'm I'm pretty sure it's gonna be like the three yellow stars. I'm not seeing that. Oh, maybe it's these fungal clusters. I'll bet you maybe that's what it is. Okay. Jade peas. Jade peas. Fungal cluster. There's a bunch of them over here. Fungal cluster, fungal cluster, fungal cluster. Yeah, let's go check those out. Is it this plant here? Wait, okay, fungal cluster. I guess it's oh yeah okay so it's these it's these things gotcha okay so that gave us oh my god we gotta get 300 of these <laughs> this is gonna take a while <laughs> yeah maybe not. as long as they're in a cluster might as well identify these plants while we're here and minerals. There's one. It's a little bit tricky to tell which one's which. It's these ones that have like the little base on them. You know, as we need more and more of this kind of thing, I really should maybe get some farming going on our, our, uh, our freighter. Okay, I think that's it for the fungal clusters in this particular area. How many did we get? 279. Okay, we're, we're getting there. more this way so some of them are together and then some of them are just kind of by themselves here it looks like okay so now we have enough let's go ahead and make our acid and then let's look at that. Craft acid, purchase wiring loan from space station, complete installation. Okay, so we install that on the mantle. All right. Um, let's go back up to our freighter. So let's see, why don't we go, what else do we need to do besides this hot brawl? Eliminate planetary sentinels. No, those are just some side quest thingies. Exploration guide, explore the Smotran system. Uh, 
I think that, I don't know what the hell that is. <laughs> Complete Nexus missions, industrial survey. I want to start Dreams of the Deep at some point. Base computer archives, visit remote archive terminal. Sentries Corps. Sentinel Sims and begin an expedition to search for answers about the Sentinels. Sentries vocalization unit has been improved by the upgrade received by the Sentinel Pillar. They have supplied another set of coordinates worthy. Yeah, let's let's just keep working on this for now, I suppose. Um Mission targets in another system. Okay. Okay, so the filter set to I think it's this system here. Alright, let's warp here. Scrambled coordinates received. Investigate the scrambled coordinates. With 14 of 16. With 14 of 16. Wait a minute. Did we just get another glyph? Uh, discoveries. No. Catalog and guide. Oh, I can't remember. Where are the glyphs at? Collected knowledge. Gek, Viking, Atlas, Portal Glyphs. I guess we did. Hmm. I thought we had to talk to all the travelers to get all of these, but apparently that's not the case. Because I've definitely not obtained 14 glyphs the way I thought I was supposed to. So, somehow or another, the game's given them to me for doing whatever it is I'm doing. <laughs> I'm not even sure what that is. Okay. Do that. Okay, so... Where do we need to go? We need to go this way. Uh, oh, we should go to the space station too and do our space station thing. should also scan this system too. Get that tech slot going there. Check extra crap modules. Minotaur cannon module and engine module. We can have up to three of those, so we might as well grab it. He doesn't have a thingy. Let's check the tool. It's a C-class. Alright, so we're done with that. I'm going to go back here for a second and scan the system so I don't forget to do it. Okay, we got an icy planet, a murky planet, a blighted planet, a rotting planet, a bountiful planet. We might need to take a look at that. And an endless morass planet. Jimeril Delta. Let's go take a look at Jimeril Delta. So we'll take a look, see at this and see I would like it. Um, and then we'll go, excuse me, we'll go do the, the quest there. <laughs> All right, so we have another reddish purplish type planet, which is similar to the one that we're already on with our planet side base. We got bubbles, we got yellow and orange and purple trees. It looks like it's a pretty mountainous place too, or at least in this region here. There's a little mountain lake here. Everything turns a royal blue at nighttime, which is kind of neat. a larger lake. Oh, yeah, actually this looks like it goes out into an ocean. Let's 
get up here. Yeah, there's a, a little C there. Let's go look at it again uh, on the day side. Hazy out now. It's 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 kind of charming, but there's nothing about it that's really you know tickling my fancy, as the saying goes. <laughs> um, okay, well, let's uh, head on back and do this mission here. Hostile ships okay, we got some. Pirate action here. Messed with the wrong dude. Hey, get out of the way, ship. Uh, squadron ships get in the way. Okay. Let this continue. Looks like we need to put our heat protection back on again. You know what we could do is... Let's move that stuff over. Move that over there. Just we, we have uh, a, enough spaces now to where I can probably just keep this stuff installed moving forward. That's cold stuff. And that'll free up the inventory space for us. And it's all together, so it's all getting bonused. Alright, good. Um, do I need to charge that stuff? Yes, I do. Call in our Minotaur. Very cool. Okay. Now, let's go here and install the self greasing servos. And that is done. Self greasing servos installed. Minus 20% fuel usage. Okay. That objective is complete. Let's go inside of this building and see what's what. Oh, this is one of those blow the door open ones? Alright, we'll blow the door open then. Emergency! Emergency! Planetary manufacturing facility. 
Intrusion detected. Production pause. Waiting restart authorization. The factory terminal looks like just any other. Another anonymous facility. Another meaningless screen of data. But the numbers that scroll past call out to me. I find my hand upon the panel. A needle extends from the glove of my suit. I did not know I had a needle in my suit. I did not move my arm. Uh, uh, give in. I surrender to my exosuit. I am a statue, a powerless witness to whatever it is attempting. Wave after wave of numbers fill the terminal screen pattern, swirling as my exosuit communes with the data. At last it halts upon a prompt. I understand. Glass archive breached. Boundary status open. Download hard frame blueprints. Confirm download. The factory is a portal. An anonymous node no more. Through this window, my exit suit re receives another set of simple hard frame schematics from whatever world of data lies beneath. There was no need to feel afraid. Yeah, when I have a needle just pop out of my clothes that I didn't know was there, that's no reason to be afraid. I mean, come on. Okay, so hard frame legs. Uh, pugnium and a hard frame engine. We have all that stuff. Look at us on our bad selves. Um, whoop. Additional entry registered laylapse. The sentry deactivated unit, blah, blah, blah. Neural upgrade noted available. Proceed. Transmit upgrade packet. I don't even know what the hell's happening, but let's do it. Neural upgrade packet broadcast. Awaiting remote response. A factory deployed a neural upgrade to sentry inspector drone with E to test the results. Okay. So first of all, Let's go ahead and install your hard frame legs. This gives us less fuel usage and more boost tank size. Man, freaking tastic. Nice. Okay. Looks like he's shaking his legs out, checking them out. Let's see how well the boost is. Okay. I don't know if that was really better than what it was before, but I guess so. Oh, we have some modules to install on this dude also. Um, let's go to our exosuit. Minotaur engine module. Put that there. Daedalus engine Icarus fuel system. These guys should be... No, we don't get a... Why don't we get a bonus with these? They're engine modules. I don't know. Warning. Let's shoot the pirate from here. <laughs> That's not working too well. Okay, so this is in a, um, yeah, that's in a turbo slot, but I don't know why putting these next to this doesn't give it a bonus. Uh, yeah, I don't get that. What about putting this next to here? Does that get a bonus? Does that get a bonus? Does that get a bonus? Uh-uh. Yeah, don't know what the deal is with that. Minotaur bore, Minotaur cannon, vectorized stabilizer. Okay, so let's go back to here. We have two of these. And that will, um, so that should boost our, our damage quite a bit there. I'm thinking maybe what we ought to do is put our, let's put the cannon in there, put this here, and maybe put that there. Now that's that's not giving a bonus either. Oh, did the hard frame items need to be next to each other for bonus? Nope, they don't. Hmm. Maybe they just don't have a bonus at all. They're their own thing. I'm guessing. Okay, so we should fairly significantly have improved our cannon damage because we added two more S-modules and we put it in a supercharged slot. 
this thing should be a lot tougher now. This is so cool. <laughs> I love it. Um, alright. So let's hop on out of here. Let's deal with these assholes. Upside down dogfight here. Okay, well, it was upside down. That takes care of that. Since we have a crash freighter here, we might as well check the stuff on it. Got some salvage data. Extreme radiation detected. There we go, cargo bulkhead. Nice. Just more salvage data. Nice, salvage freighter module. Beautiful. So, um, I believe that wraps up today's episode. Um, I'm really kind of feeling like I want to get moving towards the center of this galaxy. So probably what we'll do in the next episode is we'll, we'll just start moving towards the galaxy. We'll stop at space stations along the way and continue the suit upgrades, checking for the multi-tool and checking for... Uh, more modules for our Minotaur and go from there. So thanks everybody for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, please hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment and share out the video and we'll catch y'all in the next episode. Bye-bye.